In this video, I want to show you how to start importing audio and creating audio cues. Without the use of plugins, the only audio type Unreal supports is 16-bit wave. Here I've generated 10 seconds of white noise using Audacity. When exporting the sound, I make sure to choose 16-bit wave. Once we're back in Unreal, we're going to go to the audio folder, right click, and import a new asset. Navigate to and load the WAV file. Once we've got the sound assets in the engine, we can take one or more of them and create a sound cue. To create a new sound cue, right click and select Sounds, then Sound Cue. Name your new sound cue and double click on it to open the sound cue editor. This editor is a visual graph, like a flowchart, that we can use to create logic. Drag your sound asset into your sound queue, or manually add a wave player node. This node represents an audio source. Let's connect it to our sound queue's output. Click on the wave player's output pin and drag a wire to the input pin on this output node. When the sound queue plays, it will now play the sound we imported. To add additional nodes to the graph, simply drag them in from the palette, or you can right-click to get them even faster. With a sound cue, we can combine sounds, loop sounds, randomize sounds, and you can even apply various effects to the sound. In this example, I shifted the pitch down to try to create the sound of a waterfall. A sound cue is really useful when you're looking to create variety in a highly repetitive sound. For example, a footstep could start out as a single simple sound. We can randomize the pitch and volume of each step by using a modulator node. If we had additional sounds of footsteps, we could use a random node to randomly pick one to play. And we could still keep the modulator for additional randomness. Let's add some logic to our sound. With a parameter and a switch node, we can play different sounds for different types of floors. The wave param is a variable that can be changed by an actor or blueprint while the game is running. 